Hi guys. Sorry. Um I'm sorry. Me de repente se me se me fue la computadora. Um okay. All right, everybody can see me and hear me okay? Yeah? Yes. Yes. Okay. All right. Perfect. So, um, all right. Well, welcome to the class, everybody. Um, thank you for patience. Okay. Um, let me just give me a few minutes so I, so I can open up again the, the, at, um, the attendance. Okay. By the way, I wanted to know how are you doing in the platform? Como vamos? How's everything in the platform, guys? Hello? There is an exercise mm -hmm. that um, is difficult for me to, to do. Okay. I have tried a lot in different right. ways mm -hmm. and it, not, it doesn't work. It doesn't work. Okay. What is the exercise and what's the problem? Okay. Um, let, me, let, me, let me look for the exercise. In, okay. in the platform. Okay, um, yeah, because that like I can help you, but I need to know um, what the, okay. the, the problem is and what the exercise is. Okay. 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 All right, good, good. Um okay. do you guys have any other questions about the the exercises? Or do you have any problems with the platform? No? Everybody's okay with the platform then? Yes, yes, yes. Okay, perfect. All right. Okay, let's um okay, so I got the the attendance again. So we'll start with um Efraín Emilio Acevedo. Just a second. Yeah. So, Emilio, uh, Afraín Emilio Cebedo, no? Stephanie Saray Martinez? Stephanie Saray Martinez? Um, Geraldine Cetrilleda. Present teacher. Perfect, thank you. Ingrid Maricela Flores. Here teacher. Great. Um, Irma Adriana Segura. Present. Okay, very good, thank you. Um, Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Juan David Madrid. Present teacher. Okay, very good. Um, Carla Melissa Colocho. Here. Okay, very good. Uh, Kevin Josias Flores. Kevin Josias Flores. Okay. Um, Lucia Elena Cepeda. Present, Acuérdense, chicos, que necesitamos sus cámaras encendidas. Es que les eh, ruego que puedan, por favor, encender sus cameritas para la asistencia. 
Um, Merin Daniela Carranza. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Milagro de la Paz Jimenez. I'm here, I'm here. And Miss, I already, I'm, I'm here and I already sent the, the exercise in a, in a message on the chat here in the platform. Oh, okay. Okay, got uh -huh. it. Okay. okay. I will I will check it out in a moment, okay? Thanks. Um okay, and yeah, and then you can tell me what is the problem and I'll I'll look into that. Okay. okay. All right, let's continue. Um Mirna Janet Landos. Eh, Nelson Adán Cerón. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you very much. Present. Great. Patricia Esmeralda García. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you. Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Patricia Margarita Castellanos. Roberto Isaías Molina. Roberto Isaías Molina. Okay, not here. Uh, Ronald Alex, Alexis Martinez. Present. Okay, very good. Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. Roxana Elizabeth Díaz. Okay, and Sandra Elizabeth Asensio. Sandra Elizabeth Asensio. Okay, all right, guys and girls. Um, Okay, so we are going to start um, with um, just a second. Okay, just flip and check out the list. Get up, please, the person. Okay. Oh, by the way, guys, remember that we are on the second, um, the second week. That means that um, they will be checking that you have finished section one, section two, section three, and the a midterm okay so make sure that you have at least done the three sections and the midterm okay si, si no lo han hecho si les va a caer ahí notificación verdad de que perdón de que ustedes no lo han terminado así es que tomen eso en cuenta okay okay guys sorry I don't know why it's taken so long. Okay, yeah. Ahorita más un. Ya empieza a abrir. Okay. So, we... Um, So yesterday we started talking about compound nouns, right? So can you give me examples of some compound nouns that you remember? Photocopy. Very good, photocopy, excellent. Uh, another? Mm. Which one is for the Fingerprinting. Fingerprinting, very good. 
Anything else? Create the menus in a restaurant. Hmm? Create the menu in a restaurant. Okay, so, all right. That's true. We, we learned those verbs, but um, compound nouns, though, are the nouns that are composed of two parts. Okay, so composed usually of two nouns that create one noun. Okay, travel mm -hmm. reservation. Mm, no, two nouns that make one. For example, photo copier. Sold. Okay. Uh, or for example, um, uh, home work. Yes, mid term. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Household. Okay. Household. Very good. Yeah. Anything else? Anything Internet. Else? Very good. Yes. Internet. Online. Online. Okay, good. Yes. So what do you remember? What when you have compound nouns, which syllable is the one that is stressed? Uh, the first syllable. Good. Most of the time, the yeah. first syllable is the one that we stress. Okay? Yeah. So we say, for example, photocopier, okay. homework, internet, online. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. All right. So just keep that in, in mind so that um, it will be easier for you to work on your pronunciation. Okay? All right. So right now, I'm going to be sharing... the conversation do you see this conversation yes yes yeah yeah okay so i want you to listen and repeat okay i read the instructions i read the instructions everybody I read the instructions. I read, I read the instructions. instructions. But I'm still not sure. But I'm still not sure. How to use my cell phone. How to use my cell phone. Actually, it's pretty easy. Actually, it's very actually, actually it's pretty easy. First of all, first of all, don't forget to turn it on. Don't forget to turn it on. Good. Got it. 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 Then dial the number. Then, then dial the number. number. And remember. And remember, remember to press the send button. Press the send button. button. That's all. That's all. all. Pretty much. Pretty much. Pretty much. Just make sure, just just make sure, sure to, to recharge the batteries. To recharge the batteries every few weeks. Every few weeks. Every few weeks. And try not to drop. And sorry. Try, and try not to drop it. And try not to drop it. Not to drop it. Just for child. It's fragile. It's fragile. 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 Good advice. 
Good advice. And one more thing. And one, and one more, more thing. thing. Be sure to pay. Be, be, sure. Sure. be sure to pay the phone bill every month. The phone bill every month. Every month. Good. Bravo. Excellent. Okay. So remember, it, for okay, so better said, can you identify what are the the call uh, the compound nouns? Yeah. In, yeah, which ones are they? Cellular Cell cellular phone. Very good. Cellular phone. What else? Turn it on. Turn it on. Phone Turn bill. No, nouns. These are nouns. Nouns. No, okay. Phone bill. Yes, very good. Phone bill. Yep. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, and if I'm not mistaken, that is it. Now, so it would be cellular phone. Can you repeat? Cellular phone. Cellular phone. Cellular phone. Phone. Cellular phone. Cellular phone. Cellular phone. Phone bill. Phone bill. Phone bill. Phone bill. Phone bill. Phone bill. Good. Excellent. Okay. So notice with stress is going to be on the first syllable. Cellular phone. Phone bill. Okay. Do you have questions about the pronunciation? No. Did you say Daya? Daya. Daya? Yes, Daya. Daya, okay. Brad? Sorry, Milagro, I didn't understand your question. Richard said about then pronunciation. The number is a oh, dial. Oh yes, dial. Correct. Dial. Yeah, okay. dial. Mm -hmm. Anything else? Any other questions about pronunciation? Fragile. Fragile. Yeah. Yeah. Fragile. 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 Mm -hmm. Thanks. Yeah. Fragile. Drop it. What mean drop it? Drop it. Okay. So you want the the meaning. Okay. Drop. What is drop? Drop. Drop it. Yeah. It, 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 let it go. And then it falls. Okay, so you're grabbing onto something and then poof, if you let you drop it and it falls to the ground. That's mm -hmm. drop. Okay. Anything else? No? No. Okay. I have a doubt. Yes. Uh, recharge is a compound noun? No. It's not a no? Greek. No, it's not a Greek uh, compound noun. What is a noun? Mm -hmm. Charge. No, what is a noun? Uh, I know the the name of something. No. What does it mean, noun in Spanish? Nombre. No. What is noun? Sujeto. No. What is noun? 
sustantivo. Yeah? So, noun is a sustantivo. So, a noun is, is a person, is a thing, or is an animal, or it's a place. So, um, if you say compound noun, it means a noun that is composed of two parts. And recharge is not a noun, it's a verb. Charge, okay. Um, you say that the noun is a sustantivo, like a person. Uh, what about the subject? The subject is a person too? All right, that's why it's a noun. Mm -hmm. yeah. So recharge comes from the word charge and recharge uh -huh. means to charge again, right? Uh -huh. So yes. that's why it's a verb. Mm -hmm. So that's why it can't be a it can't be a noun because it's a verb. Mm -hmm. Okay, does that make sense, Patricia? Yes, yes. What's it that to me? No problem. No problem. Okay. Any other questions? No other questions? No. Okay, so what I'm gonna ask you to do is I want you to practice this conversation with a partner. I'm gonna be sending you the conversation in um, the chat. Just give me a moment, guys, because um, my WhatsApp web is recharging again. Como se me reinició la computadora. Okay, do you see it? Yeah. Yes. I'm seeing you. Yeah, everybody sees. Okay, perfect. So I'm going to put you into breakout rooms to practice. I just want to make sure that uh, people are there. I don't see Mina Janet, Marin Daniela, Irma Adriana, and Roberto Isaias. I don't know if you're there. Okay, Irma Adriana, are you there? Irma Adriana? Okay, here we go.
Efraín, Emilio, Irma, Adriana, Roberto Isaías, ¿están ustedes ahí? Hola, ¿ninguno de los tres está ahí? Okay. Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Meeting Daniela, uh, Nelson Adan. Yeah, I think Nelson, um, I don't know, he's in work. He's working, I think. Nelson? Nelson Adan? Yeah, in the chat. Ok, Nelson, necesito que usted me identifique antes de ponerlo en un grupo, porque si lo pongo en un grupo y después su compañera o su compañero no tiene con quién trabajar. So, I need you to tell me before. Ok, now I, I'm going to have to change. Maybe I, I'm going to have to put her somewhere else. Ok. Good advice. Good advice. Mm -hmm. Good advice. And, good advice. And one more thing: be sure to pay the phone bill every month. Okay. Now it's dark. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry. I read the instructions, but I'm still not sure how to use my cellular phone. Actually, it's pretty easy. First of all, don't forget to turn it on. Got it. Then dial the number and remember to press the send button. That's all? Pretty much. Just make sure to recharge the batteries every few weeks and try not to drop it. It is fragile. Fragile. <laughs> Good advice. And one more thing, be sure to pay the phone bill every month. <laughs> For a child. <laughs> For a child. For a child. Not, not to drop it. Drop it. Uh, uh -huh. And not try not and try not to drop it. Uh -huh. Drop it. And the other word. Dial the number. And let me see. Dial the number. Dial the number. Ah, then uh -huh. dial. Dial the number. Uh -huh. Dial the number. Uh -huh. If you go okay. up, you will find to turn it on. To turn it on. Don't forget to turn it on. Ah, first of, first of all. First of all. First of all, first of first of all, ah, second, first of all, uh -huh. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. first of all, first of all, don't forget to turn, turning on, turning no. on, mm -hmm. turning on, mm -hmm. okay, como unidas, se escuchan como mejor cuando se unen. <laughs> Sí, pero, ajá, uh -huh. pero se nos traba la lengua. <risa> sí, pues sí. A mí uh -huh. la que me cuesta es esa, esa fragile, fragile, pero ¿qué es la primera vez? Que fragile. La fragile. Fragile. Fra fragile. 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 Yes. Fragile.
All right, guys. Um, all right, any questions about the pronunciation? No? Okay, perfect. All right, guys, we are going to begin. Um, or better so not begin, we're gonna continue there with um um talking about the um we're gonna be well we're gonna be talking about this idea of um in, uh, of um infinitive complements. So I need you guys to tell me if you can see my screen. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, good. All right. Let me just make a little bit smaller. I think you'd be better if it's going to be just a little bit smaller. Okay, so, um, so infinite complements. Okay, so we have here um, what it means infinitive complements is um, we have here the the beginning, let's say, of um, which is like in a in an in, uh, imperative uh, format. Okay, so if you notice. We say, don't forget. Don't forget. Yeah, don't forget. Remember. Remember. Make Remember. sure. Make sure. Try not. Be uh, sure. Uh, be sure. Be sure. Yeah. So be this sure. is, all of these are in the a, in the infinite, sorry, in the imperative format, right? Remember the imperatives? Do you remember imperatives? Do you remember what imperatives are? Or no? Or on, take out. Exactly. Yeah. So imperatives are like let's say like orders or encouragements or directions um for example we can say um sit down uh get up um come on Um, we can say uh, run. Okay, we can say run. Yeah. So these are like orders, and we use them in the. We just put it, put the verb in the original form. We don't change anything. And in the negative, we'd say for something like, for example, don't worry, don't be late. Don't smoke. Okay, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, so that's the imperative. So if you notice in these ones, we start with the imperative. We always start with the imperative. Don't forget, remember, make sure, try not, be sure. Yeah? After that, should I just give me a moment? Okay, after that, we're going to be using the infinitive as a complement. Okay, so what are we not going to forget? We're not, we're not going to forget to turn it on. We're not going to forget to turn it on. What are we not, what are we going to remember? To press, press. the send button. Okay. 
What are we going to make sure? To recharge the batteries. What are we going to try? Not to drop it. This is the negative, okay? So in the negative, we use the infinitive as a complement with the not, okay? Not to drop it. Be sure. What are we going to be sure about? To pay the phone bills every month. Does that make sense? Yeah. Any questions? Uh, yes, teacher. So in the grammar, we always have to use to to connect the imperative to the action. Can you repeat the question again, Marin? In the grammar, like saying the infinity complements, mm -hmm. we always have to use to connect the action with the other, the word to. Right, that's why it's called the infinitive, infinitive complement, because the infinitive is actually the two infinitive. Okay? okay, we always put it. Now, if it's negative, we just make sure that the not goes before it. So not to drop it. We never say to not drop it. We say not to drop it. Okay, so the not always comes before the two. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. It does. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Anything else? Anything else you want to ask about? Okay. Uh, Milagro, you have a question? Yes. All of them are mandatory, but if I add please at the beginning or at the end, what happens? Um, it just makes it more polite. Okay, so you can. Okay, but always, always is an order, right? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it's it's an order or um an a direction, uh, an um indication. Um. But it just makes it more polite and people are going to probably be willing to do things a little bit more. Could, yeah. be, could be a piece of, of advice because mm -hmm. like remember to press the send button is not like imperative. It's like an advice, a piece of advice, no? Yeah, imperatives can be used to give an order Mm -hmm. to give um, an, a direction or indication, to give encouragement, and to give advice as well. What, what is the meaning of encouragement? Encouragement? Um, like when you say, like, come on, you can do it. Yeah, like... Um, it's like, like, um, like cheer up some, somebody, no? Yeah, yeah. Some, Don't give like up. Don't give up. Uh, 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 yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Okay. All right. So, so yes, infinity is or imperatives can be used for all of those things. It's not always in order. Okay. Okay. All right. Now, speaking of pieces of advice, these down here are pieces of advice. So we have unplug it after use it, save your work often, recharge the battery often, keep it away from keep it away from water, don't spill drinks on it, don't put put metal in it, uh, don't heat closed containers in it, don't expose it to extreme heat or cold. What I want you to do, very simple, very easy, I want you to identify are these advices, uh, sorry, are these pieces of advice um, referring to the microwave oven, to the hairdryer, to the laptop computer, or is it more than one of those ones? So if it's if it's microwave oven, you can put an M, a hairdryer, you put, you put an H, the laptop, an L, 
And if it's more than one answer, you can just put a plus, right? You can put like a plus sign. So um, I'm going to give you a few minutes there to, um, to figure it out. Give me a chance to figure out how to do it. Okay, are we ready? Yeah, I, I think so. Yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Perfect. Okay. All right, let's check. Um... Okay, so unplug it after you use it. Unplug it I after you use it. Hair dryer? Hair dryer, okay. Anything else? Will be <laughs> everything. Is that it? Only hair dryer? I think. Yeah. Do you think it could be um, possible with the laptop computer? Did I save your work often? Hold, hold on, hold on. No. I'm talking about number one. Do you think we can use it also for laptop computer? I don't think so because laptop sometimes is uh, working with uh, batteries. Yeah, and you, you're right. It's at some times. Yeah. Yeah, um, if you own. don't have battery, you have to. Yeah, exactly. For example, yes. right now I'm using a laptop, but my laptop does not have a battery, so I have to, um, I have to, uh, what's it called? Um, use it always. Um, I'm, I, it always has to be charged or charging, right? So, yeah, it depends. So I, yes. I think it, I think it's possible to have laptop computer i think okay all right save your work often and uh, laptop computer yeah definitely recharge the batteries often laptop computer okay very good keep it away from water The three, of them. Hmm? the three of them yeah definitely three yeah. of them mm -hmm. yeah, you don't want to have water near any of them 
Don't spill yes. drinks on it. Uh, laptop computer. Um... Yeah. Laptop computer. Mm -hmm. And yeah, that's pr pr probably it. Don't put metal in it. Microwave oven. Yes, yeah. definitely. Make our way of oven. Don't heat closed containers in it. Mm -hmm. Don't heat closed containers in it. And microwave oven. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Microwave oven. And don't expose it to extreme heat or cold. Um, I think lap lap computer, but I'm not sure. Mm-hmm. Laptop, right? Yeah, laptop computer. Very good. All right, bravo. Any questions about that? Mm -hmm. Okay. We're going to go uh, for a little bit longer um, just because um, just because we need to uh, replace a little bit of the time that we lost okay. at the beginning, okay? So, mm -hmm. um, hold on a second. Okay, all right, so um, I want you to look at these six uh, pictures. One's a fax machine, the motorbike, camcorder, inline skates, ATM car, personal, watercraft. What I want you to do is I want you to write an advice for each one of them. Okay, so think about an advice. For example, um, let's say, let's say that we have the, um, the, I don't know, the ATM part, let's say. I'm going to put ATM card. So what could be some advice for the ATM card? For example, it could be um, don't, okay, don't don't forget don't forget to um, to save it in a um safe in your place. wallet or in your wallet or in your wallet could be yeah mm -hmm. okay but so don't forget to save it in a in a in a safe place so in this case we are using it we're using the don't forget right the imperative, and after that, we're using the um, the the infinitive complement to save. Okay, so I want you to write one for each one of them. Okay. Are we, are we going to listen something? No, 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 just I no, want to identify to the, the, no, no, oh, no, no, you're just you're just going to create your own okay. advice, okay? And while you guys are doing that, I'm actually for all, of, for all of them, yeah, for all of them, for oh, all of them. Okay. And nice. while you are doing that, I'm going to be taking attendance, okay? Mm, okay. It's a machine. Okay, so you guys continue. Are you still seeing the, the picture? Siempre lo están viendo? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, yeah. all right. So you guys continue doing that. 
Sí, lo siguen viendo, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay. All right. Efraín Emilia Acevedo. Eh, Stephanie Saray Martínez. Eh, Stephanie Saray Martínez. Um, let's see. Geraldine Nisette Villeda. Present. Okay, very good. Um, Ingrid Maricela Flores. Here, teacher. Um, very good. Irma Adriana Segura. Present. Um, very good. Jose Alejandro Vaquerano. Present. Okay, very good. Uh, Juan David Madrid. Present teacher. Very good. Carla Melissa Colocho. I'm here. Excellent, very good. Kevin Josias Flores. Kevin Josias Flores. Lucia Elena Cepeda. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Eh, Merin Daniela Carranza. Present teacher. Milagro de la Paz Jiménez. I'm here, I'm here. Excellent. Eh, Mina Janet Landos. Present teacher. Very good. Nelson Adán Cerón. Nelson Adán Cerón. Patricia Esmeralda Garcilla. Present. Very good. Patricia Margarita Castellano. I'm here, teacher. Very good. Roberto Isaias Molina. Roberto Isaias Molina. Ronald Alexis Martinez. Present. Okay, good. Roxana Elizabeth Diaz. Roxana Isabel Díaz. Sandra Elizabeth Asensio. Present teacher. Okay, very good. All right. Thank you. Okay. Um, how are you doing? How are you doing with the Eh, but, chicos, um, lo que les voy a pedir es de que um, se están teniendo problemas con la plataforma. Eh, escriban en el chat el, 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 el ejercicio para que les pueda ayudar. Um, porque cuando se cuando terminemos la clase, el chat acá se, se va a borrar. Ya no les voy a poder ayudar. Entonces, um, ay, mándenlo, por favor, al, al chat de, de, de WhatsApp. ¿Ok? Ok, okay. Miss. All right, are we finished? Not yet. Not yet? Ok, I'll give you one more minute.
Okay. All right, guys, um, we're going to stop there for a moment. What we'll do is we're going to be checking um, your sentences next class. OK, so in um, we will be checking a, on Monday. OK, we will be checking your, your sentence. So keep it. Um, keep your sentences there. Don't forget them. And we will be comparing and sharing on Monday. Any questions? No? Okay. All right, guys. So that will be all. I will see you on Monday. Have yourself a wonderful weekend. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.